Hello folks, we're here again for another British Accent Daily News, and today we're looking at Vauxhall's uncertain road ahead, but we don't really care about that. We're looking at the er uh sounds, such as in uncertain, as you can see here. This er uh sound could do various things in various accents. Russian accents make it uncertain. Uh, Scouse accents make it un uncertain. Uh, loads of other accents do it different ways, and a lot of them will say the R as well. For instance, Americans will say uncertain. Spanish will say uncertain, uncertain, and even Scottish will say uncertain. Um, so we're kind of looking at just basically getting our eye in on these er uh sounds. So let's get it going. Vauxhall's uncertain road ahead begins. Carlos Tavares, the man who will determine the future of Vauxhall workers, downplayed the threat to more than 4,000 Vauxhall workers. Oh, I missed workers up there. Workers, you know, it's not workers. But he chose his words very carefully. The head of the PSA insisted that the new combined company would have an opportunity to set new internal benchmarks for performance. They will allow plants to be compared and improve. Production, com uh, production commitments expire in 2021 for Ellesmere Port and 2025 for Luton. After that, it will be every plant for itself in a battle for jobs. Not been so many in these last few. The combined company will have 24 factories, and everyone at the Geneva Motor Show agrees that is a few too many. Several senior executives who asked not to be named had the same message. God, there's no, none here. Let me zoom down. Uh, no, can't see any here. <clears throat> can't see any here. What? Okay, here we go. Uncertainty over Brexit and the terms of trade with Europe is one handicap. The fall in sterling is another. Although labour costs have gone down, the price of the 75% of parts for a Vauxhall Astra that come from Europe has gone up. Having said that, Mr. Tavares said that in in that in the event of a hard Brexit, it may be more, not less, important to have manufacturing in the UK. Okay, so we've got some words here such as determine, workers, words, all of these words internal, which all use this er uh sound. So it's an important one to get right. Make sure it's not too far at the front, internal. Make sure it's not too far at the back, internal. So make it internal. Cool. I've been Matt from Voice Hacker. You can find me for lessons at matt at voicehacker.co.uk or you can find me at voicehacker.co.uk, whatever you like. Find more research, find more um, uh, videos like this on the website. And you can find me on Twitter at mpocock1, but just search for Matt Pocock Voice. I'm sure something will come up. Anyway, you can come and get me for Skype lessons or just come and ask me a question. Or like this video, comment on this video, you know which call. Anyway, I'll see you guys soon.